Hi there, I'm David Kidwell, conductor of the Holyoke Civic Symphony. We've got two of everything at our upcoming concert. We've got two great pieces by Brahms, two fantastic soloists and a double concerto, and two portraits for orchestra, which were commissioned especially for our 50th anniversary season. The concert is entitled Seeing Double, and it's going to be on Sunday, March 5th at 3 p.m. at Holyoke Community College. It's a free concert, but donations are gratefully accepted. The first piece on our program is the Tragic Overture of Johannes Brahms. It was written in 1880 at the same time as his Academic Festival Overture. And Brahms famously said of the two pieces, one laughs while the other weeps. Now there's no specific tragedy that Brahms is trying to commemorate. The word tragic simply refers to the character of the music in general. The first theme is made up of rising and falling complementary phrases in D minor. And the second theme is a gorgeous, expansive theme in the relative major of D minor, which is F major. Our second helping of Brahms is the double concerto for violin and cello. It was written in 1887, and it's Brahms' last orchestral work. It was dedicated to the violinist Josef Joachim, who was a close friend of Brahms. The two men had a falling out in the early 1880s, and Brahms wrote the double concerto as a peace offering, which Joachim accepted. The piece is in the traditional three-movement format, and the first movement is in sonata form, with a fiery first theme and a wistful second theme. The solo violinist for our performance will be Ron Gorevic, who is on the faculty at Smith College and is the principal violist with the Springfield Symphony. And the solo cellist will be Melissa Westgate, who has played with the Springfield, Albany, and New Haven orchestras and frequently plays for productions at Radio City Music Hall in New York City. The Holyoke Civic Symphony commissioned four new pieces to celebrate our 50th anniversary, and we are premiering one of those pieces at each concert this season. For the March concert, we commissioned Vermont composer Zeke Hecker, and the piece he wrote is entitled Two Portraits for Oboe and Orchestra. They are two short movements, and they are in contrasting styles, but they both share the same musical theme. Here's the composer to tell you about it. When David Kidwell asked me for a piece for the Holyoke Civic Symphony's 50th anniversary. My first thought was, what would that piece be like? You always need a starting point. Well, I thought, Holyoke Civic Symphony, that's HCS. In German musical notation, H is a B and S is an E flat. And of course, normally C is C. So I figured HCS is B, C, E flat and I built the entire piece out of those three notes. Holyoke Civic Symphony oboist John Vance will be the featured soloist for the piece. I hope you'll join me for our Seeing Double concert on Sunday, March 5th at 3 p.m. at Holyoke Community College. Thanks for listening, and I hope to see you in the audience.